رسوله المصطفى وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم تسليما كثيرا يا رب العالمين اللهم ربنا لك الحمد كما ينبغي لجلال وجهك وعظيم سلطانك رضينا بالله ربا وبالإسلام دينا وبمحمد نبيا صلى الله عليه وسلم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله Allah, my dear respected, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant you all barakah and your health, wealth and time and may he azza wa jal grant us Jannatul Firdaus all ameen with our beloved ones, Allahumma ameen. We are again with the hadith of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, sallu ala rasulillah. When it comes to the teachings of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, we prepare ourselves to hear the most wisdom from the most wise the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam and we take the hadith of the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam to the core of our a'mal and our intentions even some of the salihin he used to dress up really nice and put the best of colognes when he used to teach people about the hadith of the, of the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam out of respect and honor to the hadith of the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam so with that, inshallah, we continue our chapter talking about the Sunan. Last time we talked about how important the Sunan uh, uh, that are, you know, after uh, obligatory Salah or Salat al-Wajibah and before and after for certain Salawat. These Salah Sunnah. How did the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam perform these Salawat? What was the best, uh, what ayat did he Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam recite in each Raka'ah? Because there is a lot of a hadith about the ibadah, we're also following the sunnah of the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam. Thus, we are following the footsteps of the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam. Thus, we get the reward of sunnah and the reward of uh, the the sunnah of applying what the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam has has applied, and also the sunnah within itself. So let's get into this chapter. The first one is talking about briefing or briefness to be adopted in performing the two rak'ah of sunnah of Salat al-Fajr. Salat al-Fajr, the, obligat the obligatory salah is two rak'ah and before these two, two rak'ahs there is sunnah al-Fajr. Aisha radiallahu anha narrates that the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam used to pray these two rak'ahs in a light fashion in a brief fashion between the adhan and iqamah min salat al-subh from the fajr prayer and also in a different or in a, in a narration of Bukhari and Muslim also she says yusalli rak'atayi al-fajr he would sallallahu alayhi wa sallam perform two uh, rak'ah of fajr and make them so short in dura 